Hi Jurassic Cuties, Wendy here. Today we're going to drop pusheen shopping, so let's get started. To drop pusheen at the market, let's first start by drawing a slight slanted line. So right here, I'm just going to go ahead and draw a little bit slant. And this is right in the uh, top of her head in the center. And then from there, I'm going to go up with two ears. So we're going to go up, round off the tip, and down. So same thing on this side. Go up round off the tip and down. So your goal is just give it a slight slant. From there, I'm going to bring this down more. So I'm just going to drag this out. And this side is going to come down a little bit straighter. From there, let's come back up here and put in some details. So let's start with the stripes on her head. So I'm just going to draw three U's basically right here. Then from there, I'm going to start and uh, draw her nose and mouth area. So finding your center, come down, say about right here. And we're just going to go straight and then curve out. And same thing on the other side. So just remember, everything is still at a slight slant. Then from there, we're going to come across right here in this area and draw a circle for her eyes. And I'll just come in here with a small little highlight and then shade the rest in. So same thing over here. So about right here. There. So I have her eyes in. So then I'm going to come out here before I forget and draw her whiskers. So this one comes through. So it's just two of them. And on this side, they don't go through. They just kind of start right here and come out. Okay, so then from there, let's bring this down a little bit more. So we're going to start to draw the body, her hands. Let's bring this out. So this side is definitely a lot wider and this is coming down straighter. So about right there, I'm going to stop about right here. And I'm going to draw a hand that's holding the shopping cart. So right here, I'm going to curve out and loop it around. So if you're using a pencil, definitely finish pushing its body first, then come back in. But since I can't erase, I'm going to stop right about right here, draw the hand. I'm going to come right across. So just imagining a handlebar. So about right here, I'll draw the other hand. So it's just another curve, same thing. Then from there, I'm going to connect this with an angle line right in this area where Pusheen's hands are. It went a little too round. <laughs> okay, so then I'm going to stick out the handle. So I'll come out, give a little curve, and same thing here, just a little curve and connect. There. So she's holding on to the shopping cart handle. Then from there, we're going to angle this down. So we're going to put an angle line down and here as well. So whatever angle this becomes, just make sure this one follows. So then from there, we're going to stop and draw another angle line. So we're following the top. To start our cart. Okay, so then from there, um, let's bring this angle here down now. Now we're going to start the shopping cart body. So I'm going to bring this down. Just a little angle. And before I finish any of this, I'm going to let's uh, make sure we know where pushing is going to go. So I'm going to come back in here. So about right here, her body's going to come through and just want to make sure so let's bring out machine so we know where she ends so we know where it how um, tall to make the shopping cart so let's bring pushing down uh, about right there and then just start to bring it in so then just imagine this coming through so about right here 
And let's finish pushing off first. And before I finish this curve, there's a little foot right here. I'm going to pop out to the curve and then in. And her other foot is about in this area. And it's kind of curled up. So just draw a little curve right there. <gasps> so silly, right? Okay, so then let's draw her tail. So about in this area, I'm going to come out and pop out her tail. Just curve. And back in. And let's draw the stripes in her tail. So there's three stripes. And then her back stripe. So about right here, I'm going to add one curve and another one. So now that we know where Pusheen's legs are, we can go ahead and finish the cart. So let's bring this down more. And we just want to end this cart around her foot area. So say about right here, I'll stop. And then from there, I'm going to start to build this cart. So I'm going to angle. This is my angle right, I mean my point right here. And I'm going to draw an angle line across. about right there. So I'm creating this little um, box here. So about right in this area, I'm going to give it a slight angle. And I'm going to connect this following that angle. So let's come right here. And create one side. And then we're going to go across right here, following this make it a little bit easier and about right there we're going to stop and bring this down as well and connect their box is coming together <laughs> and so i'm going to leave this open for now and let's come over here and draw the wheels so right here in this corner i'm just going to go ahead and draw a circle and another one right here in this corner and one more right here. There. Okay, so then now that we have that, now let's fill this cart up. So um, in the original Pusheen drawing, there's a box right here, but I made this part a little bit complicated. So I'm not going to put that in. I'm just going to say put in a big, um, big watermelon. So I'm just going to draw a big melon right here. And then maybe about here, I'll put in like a little can, something. It's all up to you what you want to fill your cart with. And there's like a milk bottle here. And there's an apple right here. So in about in this area, let's see about right here, put in an apple. Okay, so I'm filling up the space and then in this area, we're going to stick a baguette in here. So put the draw the bag here. So at the same angle, I'm going to stick in this bag, the top of the bag. And then let's stick our baguette up here. Fix my angle here. Okay, and then there's it's like these marks right here on the baguette. And um, let's finish our contain our cart here. So about right here, I'm just gonna angle, following this angle all the way across. Okay, so definitely if you're using a pencil, draw this whole shape first before you put all the things in there. It just makes it a lot easier. There. And then in this area, just to fill up this space, I'm just going to uh, put something else around as well. And let's make this look like a watermelon. So I'm just going to put some stripes through this. There. 
hopefully that looks like a watermelon and then let's draw some lines on this shopping cart so kind of we'll find your center and follow the angle and I'm going to draw two going across and so same thing here about right here I'm going to kind of follow this angle and then this side kind of follow that angle as well a little bit off just slanted this a little bit more okay so then once again I'm just gonna come right across right here and here and draw a line across to finish my cart my wobbly cart <laughs> Okay, I have a lot of fixing to do, but hopefully that was able to help you get an idea on how to draw this cart. There. Okay, so um, let's add a heart right here because I do need to add a heart on my drawing, right? So put on this little baguette package right there. And that is pretty much it for Pusheen shopping. And I really hope I made this fun and easy for you to follow along with me and that this drawing here really inspires you to draw it too. Thanks so much for watching. And if you haven't already, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.